Just look at this place. This is across the street from my gallery. And I'll be painting that. This is my setup here today. That's a scene. This is this painting I did a couple times before. But those trees, whenever they're in bloom, they're so beautiful. I feel like I should do it again. Goes up into the orchards. If you look down here, you'll, you'll see the ducks. There's so many of them, see? There's a gazebo. I spent many a time here with the owner of the ranch. Very incredible people. I'm just fortunate to be here. I want to do a big painting of this as some kind of a recognition and memory because the owner of the ranch passed away while well, the husband did. And uh, I remember the last painting I painted here was with him. I did the sketch with him and then I did the final in my studio. And I want to almost dedicate this painting to, to Joe. So I guess stick with me today. I'll be doing a small 9x12 to get a feel for the loose brush. Thanks. I'll see you guys. This is a painting I started out in a field. Look at those brush strokes. See if I can get it better for you. Palette knife. It's a garden across the street from my gallery. On a lighter note, there's my palette that created it. Some of the knives. See, I got a new knife. Got a bunch of new knives. And. But I really like the way the palette knife, it gets jagged, ragged, almost like a, like it was my palette itself. I hope you guys like it. This piece will be framed in the gallery for $595. It gets the pewter gold frame. It's gonna be awesome. Nice piece. I hope the camera got the uh, good color on it. I'll see you guys on the next one. I got a few going on right now, I'll be showing. 
document them in video so you guys can see them. All right, happy painting, you guys. Take care. Well, here's that painting I did a long time ago of the same garden. Thought I'd share this with you. This one hangs at my house, and I love it. <laughs>